Well, Art in the Park has been a Bemidji summer staple for over 50 years, but this year, attendees saw a new setup for the event. Reporter Sherelle Moore has a closer look. I come here every year and uh, I always enjoy it. It's uh, like today, it's a beautiful day and, uh, and there's a lot of beautiful things to see. Just talking to the guy to do in the stained glass and uh, just a lot of stuff. I love woodwork too, so. A cherished Bemidji tradition returned this weekend with a new look. This year, more than 100 artists, designers, and food vendors set up shop for Art in the Park. Since there was construction at Library Park, the event was split between the park and the Watermark Art Center across the street. I don't know what the old setup was like, but the new setup, I liked it. We looked around a lot, lots to see, lots of different vendors, so it was interesting. And we sampled some of the uh, walleye fingers at the KC food booth they had set up. Signage like this was put up so that way drivers knew to be careful and be cautious while they're driving through the area. Organizers say they actually like the setup, and if it gets some good feedback, then there's a chance that it could return in the future. People are saying they're very happy with it. We were a little concerned that if it was broken up like that this year, people would be upset, but there's actually more room and everyone, everyone's enjoying it. And for once, they're going inside as well as out, so they get to see the art center as well. Reporting of Bemidji, Shrummore, Lakeland News. Organizers say they will also consider the vendor's thoughts when deciding on whether to bring the set ba setup back for next year. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.